What's going on guys? I'm Simon C. Today we've got a new video here on All Beards Eve. Halloween Eve. I hope everyone is going to have a safe and very happy beard day holiday coming up. As you can see, I'm rocking the Jack Skellington. One of the best movies, Nightmare Before Christmas. If you haven't seen it, go find it, go buy it. You need to. Today, we've got another beard oil review for you guys. And as you can see, as always, boom! Beardbrothers.us giving us the sponsor and all the support always at Simon C Gaming for the live streams which will be coming up and if you see my post on Instagram you know I had a complete bonehead moment we're not going to talk about that but always use the code up to November 15th Simon says it's going to save you 15% off I just got three brand new beard oils today in the mail and I'm looking forward to showing these guys off to you guys Look forward for that. If you want to make sure you know it before anybody else, hit the like button, subscribe. Make sure you have that notification icon on so every single time we do a video here, you get notified about some great beard oils and some of the not so great that'll save you money down the road. Today, we're heading over to Luxurious Bastards out of California. You can follow these guys at the.luxurious.bastard. Over on Instagram, these guys have a lot of cool stuff, and let's, let's just go right to it, okay? Let's see. As you can see, today we're going with the Vintage Bastard. Now, yes, the name is a little coarse, a little rough, but, you know, the, when, you, when, you, when we get through this, you'll understand why. Right now, the Vintage Bastard, another complex profile created by the man himself, Mr. David. And I'm not even going to try to pronounce his last name because I don't want him to email me going, you did that wrong because he's a cool cat and I don't want to, you know, butcher his last name. He creates all these basically and it's just amazing stuff. Best way to describe this one, you can imagine the distinguished gentleman from the 20s or 30s and... $17.50 for a full-size bottle. If you want to get the sample like I did, $4.50. Not a bad deal. I mean, this, and like I said, we're going to get to it here in just a second. I'm going to show you. Really good stuff. Let's see. Boom. Now, when you guys order from these guys, first, I do want to say this, and I wish I'd have, op I wish I'd have videoed the initial opening. Usually when you get, you know, the UPS packages or, you know, uh, USPS packages, you got your bubble wrap. This had another one that was rolled up with the product inside. These guys took care of their product. I mean, literally went above and beyond as far as making sure it's safe to make for the travel. When you open it up, a night. This is a burlap sack. Really cool. Really, really nice aesthetics. I do like that. When you open them up, you're always going to get. Nice little business card, which has all the information for these guys. You can reach out to them. You can, you can, you, it has their number. You can call the office. Okay. They have their main office. I, I'm not, I've never called it. I hadn't risked it. I don't want to take the long distance calling all the way over there. Cause I work during the day or at night, but you know, as you see the nice logo has all their Insta has their Instagram stuff, has everything they offer. That's really cool. Secondly, you're going to get your beard oil. Very, very, very basic stuff. No fancy artwork needed. Just a basic amber color Euro dropper. Just has the, the name. It's what it is. Straight to the point. Here's what was really cool. With it being Halloween time, nice little piece of bubble gum. Trick or treat, baby. Because when you look good, you always got to have that gum to make sure you're nice and calm. So we're going to get right into it with the Vintage Bastard. Like I said, nice little Euro dropper. This is the sample size one. This is, you know, I'm trying to find something. Okay. I dip tobacco. You know, it is what it is. You can see the size. It's, it's a good size, you know, about the size of a can. That's the best way I can describe that. When you open this right here. Now we're going to get right into the review on this. One out of five on the, let me adjust that real quick. I got my Minecraft, my daughter's Minecraft stuff right here. She built an Ender Dragon. It is amazing through Legos. It's it's really cool. I'll show you that one day. 
Dude, this right here, it is amazing. Very, it's very strong. Very strong musk. That's the best way to describe it. As a musk type cologne. But it's it's like it's like what they would wear in the 20s or 30s. You know, it's that proper. You, it's, it's like when you're proper. Like when you have your suit and tie, this is something you would wear back then, you know. Back when you know, you're out doing the you know the runs with Al Capone, I guess back in the day, I was before him. I'm not sure, but I know somebody will correct me in the comments on the Al Capone situation. But this stuff, it's really strong, really nice. I mean, it smells like you know a good cologne. And when you put in, I mean, so so one out of five on this one, I'm giving this a five. It's very strong, very nice, by the way, but very strong. Nonetheless, I mean, you're you, it, the old saying, just a dab will do you. Just a couple drops of this is all you need. I usually have, because where I have a very thick beard, I usually have to put a good size, about a one size dropper in this. With these Euros, I usually have to put two or three with some of the other companies. One small dropper, and everything is, you're there. You're in there like swimwear, man. I'm telling you, this is really good stuff. The longevity of the scent, this one, and I, I'm very, you guys know I'm very particular about these. I work in a factory at night, around machines, a lot of dust, a lot of other chemicals in the air. That stuff was there. I came home, I still, I mean, it, it, it was there. So, I mean, it, it stays with you. It doesn't, I mean, it fades a, it fades a little bit, but by the end of the night, I still was able to smell it. I'm giving this one a 4.5 out of 5. I mean, it didn't, st like, I could tell it dissipated some. But this right here was really nice. It stayed with you. And it smelled nice. Like I said, you it smelled like you had a good cologne on. You know? It, it wasn't, it didn't have any weird, it wasn't fruity. It, it was, boom, right to the point. Just like these guys are, I do have another one, the Tobaccoist, I will be doing a review on. This one right here was just on point, you know what I mean? It's, and like I said, and when you go back and look, I mean, for, for the price that you're getting on that, you really can't complain, you know? It's, it's good stuff, you know? They have a lot of other I'm trying to get to it real quick. There we go. Hit the right. I clicked the wrong button. I mean, they have all sort. They got one. These are just the seasonal ones. The basic ones you got deluxe, curious, sweet, Colombian, luxurious, natural, dark, the holy, the original, the 1912. It is all really good stuff. The tobacco is that that's the next one I'm going to be going with. So they got a lot to choose from. And I really think it's good stuff. Now, the beard manageability, as you go through and, you know, do this kind of stuff. Hello, my pirate. My wife just got home from a long day of being a pirate. Did you, did you scurry the seven seas, dear? Of course. Of course, she said. <laughs> and now my kitty cat. Hello. Hello, Cookie Bee. No, don't do that. That's a little loud. Okay. Getting the guys getting a little uh cameos from the D2E family. <laughs> Vintage bastard, like I said, it's it, the beard manageability was amazing. It kept it nice and soft, and it's like I said, it was easy to comb, easy to brush through as you go through the day. You're gonna be, you know, you want to brush your stuff, keep it good. You know, if it starts to get a little. You, it, it it doesn't knot up. It was really good. I highly recommend these guys. And you guys know I do have, you know, my deal with Beer Brothers. And these guys, those guys are amazing. I love their product. I do use them every single day when I'm not doing these reviews. And this is, these are some of the ones. I know you guys have heard me talk before about having my own person, my personal use collection. Okay. I have all these beard oils that I'm sampling that I'm trying for you guys. This is one that I do that I, I mean, you can see I've used a lot of it, you know, 
for beyond the review when we if you know we have those special occasions where you got to go out and you got to look good for the school you know for the kids and when you're out in school functions and stuff that's one I'll put in if I'm really wanting to make a really solid impression the beard brothers guys that, that you could use those any day of the week on everything and you know I have my guys from a couple of them from fable that I use that are amazing as well I have a lot of stuff and I have like four that I four or five that I keep that I can you know use at any time this is one of them. I highly recommend these guys. The beard manageability, 4.5 out of 5. Really good stuff. I was I was surprised, okay? I was really surprised about this. Because when you first see it, you're like, oh, okay, it's, it's basic. You know, it's simple. It's to the point. And I guess with all the other ones that we've been doing, I've had a few duds. And I got another one, which I'm really dreading to do. You'll see that one next week. Make sure you hit the like and hit the notification if you want to see what to avoid when it comes to beard oil. But this one is one I, I say check them out. Try the samples first because their, their scents are very different. Try the samples because you, one, you're gonna, still going to get a good deal on amount of oil to price. Secondly, their scents are so different that you I, I, that's why I did that usually I'll buy the you know the normal size I went with the sample because it was just so different and it was very nice it was something that you're gonna you're gonna want I think I, I really do and I really did enjoy using this one and I look forward to trying a couple more of their stuff down the road I am gonna go back and I am if you guys go I'm going to put a link to their website in the comments below. Check their website out. If you see one of the scents that you're kind of, you know, curious about, comment what scent it is and I'll try it out for you guys. I will order it and I will do it here and give you guys my honest thoughts. That way you guys don't have to take a risk. Sound like a deal? I like deals. Let's do that. You guys let me know if there's companies out there from this one or any other and I'll go check them out. I like to hear what you guys have to say. Where else was I going with that? I got the, we went through all, I mean, we went through all of it, man. We're doing pretty good today. We got a whole lot of stuff. Like I said, amazing stuff that, that to me, it reminds me of like that old barber shop smell. Like if you've ever been to not, not these sport clip hair salons, fast cuts, smart. No, if you find you one of the old school barber shops, Okay, it has that, that, that musk smell. It has that manly smell. You got it in a bottle right here. I'm from up north. We had some old barber shops growing up, and it, it, it reminded me of that as a kid. You know, sensor, you, know, you have things that remind you of things from childhood. This one right here reminded me of a, of, of a childhood memory. It reminded me of going to the old barber shop when I was a kid. When I actually had hair. Yes, that did happen. I had a nice full set of blonde hair. If I could find a picture from back in the day, I'll, po I'll post it up on Instagram if I can ever find one. I mean, I had nice blonde hair. I never understood how that happened, but it reminded me of that going to the old barbershop as a kid and getting the trim. That's the best way to describe it. Very nice. Very professional smelling. It, like I said, it doesn't take a whole lot with this stuff. Other companies, like I said, you've seen me. I've used a whole bottle. I've got another company, which here's the case for it. I'm not going to show it, but there's a case for another one I'm getting ready to do that just, it sickened me. And if you guys are with me on the live run, I'm going to do that here in just a minute. If not, if you guys are watching this on YouTube, make sure you tune in next Tuesday at 5 p.m. when it goes live. On the site and you'll see that one out but as always guys my name is Simon C head on over to beardbrothers.us use the code Simon says we're gonna get you 15% off because like I said I got three more I'm getting ready to drop for you guys hopefully I'll be able to get them in the three-day sample run that way I like I always do with everything to where I can have them up for you before the code expires because there's three more cents you've got to try Guys, my name is Simon C. I hope 
You guys have a very safe Halloween. It is going to be a full moon. A lot of the crazies going be out. If you guys have COVID restrictions in your area, please abide by them. Be safe for you, your family, your kids. Mask up. Make sure you and yours are safe. And I will hope everyone will join me on the next video.